I understand, you know, why um, some young people like him are so passionate about joining this um, school of future and how they feel like very empowered as well. Because what you do is just, you're telling them that, you know, there are other ways of doing things and it's not just sitting um, on a classroom and listening to someone that may be really boring just reading out to you something you can read yourself In school, he doesn't really enjoy going to school or school subjects. So he wants to do um, IT engineering and he chose the pathway to get to there. But the pathway chosen is not giving him any subjects that really relate to what he wants to do. So he's very into apps and you know applications and technology and IT. And what he gets in school is not really what he wants or he needs. So when he found that um, course that is helping him to think about other ways of doing things and getting the support he needs, he's really uh, passionate about it. So he spends hours and hours every day just working on the, um, he's doing that kind of, um, what the prototype. Everything really. So when he has meetings, meeting with the tutor, so everything he's really happy about and he finds it really useful. So every time he fits a meeting, he's like, oh, that was great. And he's really motivated and someone telling him, oh, that's a really good idea. Oh, I like that. And in school, you don't get that. You know, you're 30 in a room. And if you're not very keen on schoolwork, no one will tell you, oh, I really like this maths problem you just resolved. So he's also lacking that in the school. And here he gets that reinforcement that he needs. So, so far, all I see is really good things. Him being motivated, working extra hours, whatever he needs to get um, his project working and um, having discussions with um, other people my husband is a, an IT engineer and he's also um, trying to set up like a little kind of starter and he, they talk a lot about how can I improve that what do you think about this idea so he's really passionate about what he's doing with school or future really yes more um, thinking about things so instead of just being like kind of passive and just waiting for someone to tell you what to do him being active uh, learning by himself finding solutions thinking about how to improve so that's something that I've, i never saw in the past he was kind of i get that okay i'll just study this i'll do this assignment really quickly but now i see him really thinking and showing me things Look, I've done this. What do you think? Do you like the colors? Do you like the setup? And I've never seen that before. So that's a positive change that he's really proud of what he's doing. He's really enjoying that and he's having conversation with them and they're sharing their ideas. So I feel that he's really, um, he's a very sociable person anyway. So he really, wherever you put him, he will talk to people and he will want to know more about other people and talk about himself. So he's really enjoying as well, working with other people and, and sharing um, ideas with them. So that's another good approach, this putting together people that have different, um, kind of different um, ways of thinking because in school, He's got plenty of friends, but when he talks about them, it's like they just want to finish school, go to university, get a job, buy a house, have two children. And he's like, I don't want that. I want something else. I don't want to follow the normal path. So he finds sometimes like he's quite different to his peers. And in this group where he's been uh, put with the School of Future, he feels himself that he's uh, in the right place with people that have similar approaches to, to life or, or, or to the way that um, learning is perceived. Well, quite a few. I mean, every time he finishes with um, the tutor, he will tell me about, you know, I 
talk about my prototype and things that is really good and I explain about a way to monetize that with kind of virtual coins and she thought it was a great idea so he does um, talk about what he has been talking with the tutor with other co um, co-workers well there was some there was someone that has done something really uh, really good that I think it's, it was in Belgium, I can't remember now, but someone that has done a prototype that um, someone in the country is interested in um, supporting. So he was really amazed, like, wow, you know, this person has found someone that is interested in that and might get the support he needs to implement it. So really kind of positive um, every time he does. And he will never complain when he's doing as well um, a dual diploma with the US and he will complain oh I've got a session today oh eight an hour oh it was so boring and when he's doing all these meetings he's like oh I haven't, I haven't got time today I've got a meeting and Saturday he will spend two three hours on a meeting and he's like he's really happy like I need to eat at one because I need to prepare for my meeting at two and I've never seen that before so I'm really surprised that he found something that really motivates him first it was him he found that in i think it was facebook or instagram i don't know he saw that someone posted something and he started reading that and then he read that it was an alternative to to school or a different approach to learning so he did explain to me i found that and he was kind of worried like I'm not sure if that's something serious or if maybe we pay and uh, they are stealing our money. So it was kind of, I don't know if it's fake or if it's a real institution and, and there is real um, you know, sessions and learning. So I started looking into the internet and reading and looking at videos and people people's comments. So then we thought, no, that's, that's something real. Um, so if you're happy and if you're motivated, let's do it it's just you know 90 days so you can test that option and see if you like it and he was really really happy when i said okay let's go ahead and try that so that that's how we we found it yeah. he, he was the one um investigating what else can i do to um to learn and to think and someone to support me in that thinking process have really high hopes I thought um, he's really keen on that but I think it's going to be the same so someone talking and giving a presentation on I don't know, organization or motivation or um, lateral thinking so all those types of things that you can see on the internet but no I, I, I was really happily surprised um, in a positive way that it did turn really really well and the way you organize the sessions and the follow-up you do and the encouragement the motivation so that's that's really really positive so i really don't have any negative comments um, about the program so i think you're doing a really good job for people that have different interests young people that have these you know, brains that um, keep thinking and and want to do more than they do in, in regular schools i found really useful um, the youngsters comments what um, it meant for them and um, how it changed um, something inside them so those comments and those real examples and um, that helps a lot even now when you go to the website and you see those prototypes those kids that have created and and you've got this kind of hall of fame so those kids are there with a summary of what they've done so that's also really encouraging for kids for parents as well to see that there are things going on. I would say inspirational. You inspire those kids. I think it's it's a very inspiring experience and building as well on their confidence. I think you're very motivating. Or, or you, you have a very motivational approach to to this learning so i would say inspirational and motivational would be my two summary words about the, the program <laughs>